uh, Mexican. <laughs> or let's call it San Francisco, Calimex, eh? Calimex. Yes. Calimex, yes. Calimex yeah. that's what it is. Um, where did you get the inspiration to do this? Uh, the main inspo came, I lived in California for a year um, and then came back home and was pretty upset that like that food didn't exist. Yeah, yeah. But ever since we met like five years ago, he's like, I want to open this restaurant, I want to do this. And I just said, if you want to do this, you need to do it now. What's the one thing that you say you cannot have proper Mexican or Cali Mex if you don't do this? I think one of the great things about Mexican food is it's not difficult to make. Mm. Um, and running, you know, you've got fresh ingredients and you're willing to put a little bit of time in, uh, you get pretty amazing results. When people come in here, what do you expect them to experience? Introduce them to new flavors and um, yeah, new things to experience. And I think each time that someone comes here, they can have a different experience because the way that the menu is designed is a lot of different options. So trying to keep it exciting for the customers that return as well. Mm. What do you think this is going? In terms of like the quality of Mexican food keeps mm. getting better and better mm. in Melbourne. I think if you talk to people, they're like, I love Mexican food. Like everyone is like, that's so fun. That's yeah. just, it's just such a fun food to share with people and people get really excited about it. What difference does it make to have a good tortilla? What you're looking for is you want that sort of subtle corn flavor to come through. You want it to be soft and pliable and have that right chew. What's your favorite taco on the menu? All right, so I got the carnitas taco. So it's the um, the braised pork with um, chicharron. Jenna's got blue corn tortilla battered uh, rockling. 